Hi, welcome to my channel. My name is Kat and today I'm going to be sharing what we got our two boys for Easter for 2023. So what's in their Easter baskets? Um, I love doing this video. I love watching this videos every year. Um, so I just thought why not share with you guys what I got them for this year. On that note, if you guys, um, I got a few comments last year that I overdo it. And yes, I do. I'm the mom that overdoes it. So if you don't like those videos, this video is not for you because I tend to overdo it. But with that being said, um, I have a son named Cash. He is five years old and a son named Ethan. He is 11. He's going to be turning 12 in May. So um, like I said before here on YouTube, I don't see that many videos for boys as far as like baskets, gift guides, things like that. So I do like to share these videos and especially a preteen boy. So um, let's start with Cash this year since we started, I believe with Ethan last year. And I'll kind of show you the basket. I have it, all the baskets fully put together. And then I'm gonna just show you one by one um, each item and where I got it from. And if I can remember the price, also the pricing. I believe that it helps so much with, um, especially gift guides to know how much things are and where they're from. So if you guys like it, you feel free to go purchase it. So, um, his main basket, we'll start with that first is from Hearth and Ham. It is from last year. They do have them again this year. I paid $12.99 last year and this year I believe they were $14.99. So they did go up in price. But, ah, this is his main basket. His little marshmallows are falling. But I want to show you the name tag. I love it. It is from, um, it was actually an Instagram ad that popped up. It's called Personalized Mall. I believe they were running a sale. They were $19 and then they were having a sale for $4.99. And I just paid shipping. So we had one for each boy made. So I thought that was an amazing deal. And even though his marshmallows fell over, just kind of an overview of his basket. And then let's go and let's dig in and see what we got him. So um, the baskets I'm reusing, um, and I just got him like little cheapy other baskets for something else that I'll show you in the video, but I will explain that as I go. But a basket is not a basket without a chocolate bunny. And I got this adorable little chocolate bunny. He's wearing a little sweater, like how freaking cute is that? Um, from, it is a hollow bunny from Home Goods. They were $3.99 each. They did carry it like in a yellow duck and also like a white little sheet. Sorry, you guys, my hair, it bugs me. <laughs> um, but I thought this one was so cute and it was so hard to find some that weren't like broken. So I found this about a month ago and honestly, I went back multiple times trying to look for more and they didn't have any. So um, if you get your hands on this, that would be a great little addition, something just different and special. Um, this is Splendid. It's by Splendid Chocolates made in uh, Canada. So I think that is so, so cute. I was going to get the boys Seize Candy bunnies. If you know what Seize Candy is, I believe they're nationwide. Um, but those bunnies were solid chocolate and they were $20. So if, and I already had bought them all this other candy. So I thought I'll wait on that until next year and they're good with that chocolate bunny. Okay, so let's jump into the next goodie. Also from Home Goods is this marshmallow stick. How freaking cute is that? I never seen these before, I just never paid attention. But they have some really good different types of candy. And it was $3.99 also, so I got each boy one of those marshmallow sticks. And then these little pendant ban banners. This one says you are like extra special, like a dinosaur popping out of an egg. These were $1.49. I know these were really big a few years ago when they first came out um, from like private sellers or Etsy shops, stuff like that, but they were kind of pricey. So for Walmart to be doing these ones for $1.49, I thought that was a great deal. And then with his little basket, I got him a little pink sipper cup. This was $3 at Target Dollar Spot this year. They also came in pink. And then with all that candy he's going to be eating, I just got this really cute lion toothbrush and this was from Dollar Tree. So I thought that was so, so cute. I think the head pops off and his name is Rick, Ricky. <laughs> Funny. And then from Walmart, I got him these glow in the dark bracelets. It comes in a four pack for 98 cents. I don't know if you can really see, sorry, my ring light is making a glare. And then I always like to get him a Easter book. So this one is from Walmart. It says it was $3.98. It says how bunnies take baths. 
Um, but I scanned it. It is a little golden book and it actually came up, I believe 39 cents. So I grabbed it. It was the only one I found. So of course I grabbed it for cash. And then he loves Encanto, so um, I found these at Dollar Tree a few weeks ago, and I've just been holding on to all this stuff. They're little Play-Doh sets by Crazy Art. Um, this one is Maribel, and this one is Louisa. And he loves Play-Doh, you guys. He plays with Play-Doh, if he can, every day. And I usually let him, just because it keeps him busy. Um, and he loves Squishmallows. So we seen this at Five Below a couple weeks ago. And it is a bath bomb, mystery bath bomb. They were a dollar twenty-five, and he was begging for it, and I was like, "No, I'm not gonna buy it." So I ended up buying it, and then just sticking it in his Easter basket, which I thought was so cute. He's gonna be excited. Um, he does have him and Ethan both have eczema, so for cash, I just like to like let him play, almost like sensory. I give him like a bowl of water and just let him play with the bath bomb with his hands and little toys. And then this little cute headband from the 99 cent store. He loves wearing his little headbands. Um, I do like to fill their baskets also with like necessities. So he needs new shoes. And I found these ones at Ross for $22.99. They're Pumas. And I thought that was just so cute for springtime. And we do go to Disneyland quite a bit now that we have our Disney passes. So he needs comfortable shoes for Disneyland because we stay all day usually. So he has his shoes. He loves a light up necklace. He likes wearing them to school with his headband. So I found both of these from the 99 cent store. And I know everyone doesn't have a 99 cent store. So I did also see similar things at the Dollar Tree. These were $1.49. So this one is like a take on the Christmas necklace, but with Easter light bulbs. And then this one has little bunny rabbits, almost like peeps. So they both light up. Um, I don't know if they take batteries. I don't think so. I think it's the ones that just have the buttons and they're flashing necklaces. So he got both of those. And then at the Dollar Tree, um, they each boy got one of these craft chickens that you could color or paint. Um, it came in a two pack, so I just gave one to each boy. And then also from Walmart, he loves to color and doodle. Um, this is a little it says hello cutie and I thought it was just so cute with the bunnies but I'm guessing it was from leftover from Valentine's Day because it rang up it was regular seven dollars and 18 cents and it rang up 71 cents so 90% off and it comes with the markers and like how cute are these pages you guys so cute so I got him that also and then from Dollar Tree because I'm telling you this kid loves arts and crafts I got him this little peeps color um, it says color ups glow. So I don't know if it glows in the dark or what, but it's just a little peeps coloring sheet with some stick or some little markers there. And then I got him this doodle jams. I got this actually at the at home store at 90% off. It ring up, it was regular $9.99 and ring up 99 cents. So as you can see, like these little beads move. And you could create art and somehow I think you could take a picture on your phone or something and then doodle on the pad. So I thought that was just so cute for 99 cents. So I grabbed it. And we're Disney lovers. Like I said, he loves Encanto. So he's been asking for these. Um, it's a Disney Lego set um, for weeks. And I went back to my Walmart and I think they had clearance them out to from like $20 to $17. But I bought it because I it was the only one I found at seventeen dollars. But I thought it was so so cute, and he's gonna love this. He's really into Legos and building Legos right now, so I thought that was a great activity for his motor skills, stuff like that. And then every year I get him the bunch of balloons, so I got him purple and orange. These were three dollars each at Target Dollar Spot. They also sell them at Walmart. Um, Target Dollar Spot also um, just you know. A wand of bubbles they were one dollar so cute with the little carrot and then this was from walmart for one dollar the boys still like to play with these like airplanes that you build and just kind of throw in the air they're good for a few times and then it's done but they have fun also target dollar spot i thought this was so cute it's a little chick or duck and it was three dollars so it actually goes on your wrist it's called like a huggable I forgot what they call it. 
a wrist bracelet. Like, how cute is that? That is so cute. They had it in a frog, a little duck, and a cow. I don't know if they had a bunny, but I thought this one was so cute to wear to school. He likes taking little things like this to school with him. And I got him a few pairs of glasses. So these cute bunny ones were from the 99 cent store. I believe they were 99 cents and it has like little fuzzy ears. And then this is like a regular pair of sunglasses were from Target Dollar Spot. So when we go to the beach or the lake this summer, he has a pair of glasses. These were also $1. And then at the bottom of his basket or both boys baskets actually, I put some clothes. So I like to fill their things with necessities also, not just a whole bunch of junk or like food. Um, even though I do get them a lot of junk food, but you know, they're only kids one time. You know? So I got him this Harry Potter shirt at five below and I thought it was so cute. You guys, he's never watched Harry Potter, but he loves Harry Potter. <laughs> I think he likes the idea of Harry Potter. So I found this cute one. I thought it was so cute. He wears a size 5T, so I got him a size 5'6 for $5. These ones were from Walmart and they actually were, I believe like five four five forty eight, and they were clearance up for $4. But when I scanned them, um, they ring up $1. So I got him this one here and also this one here for springtime. So they're both $1. And then also from Walmart, I found him these cute little shorts. Like they look like a bandana print. They were from the line Free Assembly. They were $14. Um, they were on the clearance rack for, I think it said 11 But when I scanned them, they ring up $3. So I grabbed them and the quality feels really good. It's that um, assembly, free assembly is like their higher end line at Walmart clothing. Okay, and then last clothing item that I think besides their outfits, I'll show you guys at the end for Easter, is his pajamas. And he picked these out, but he doesn't know they were going in his Easter basket. We found these at Burlington and I paid $7.99 for them. It's blippy. So I just told him like when we left, I was like, oh, you know what? They didn't end up having your size. So I grabbed them and put them in this Easter basket. Okay, so that's his main Easter, Easter basket. His um, little one I thought was so cute this year. I went with a theme, so he loves basketball and Ethan's is gonna be soccer theme since Ethan loves soccer. Um, but Cash loves Space Jam. So I found this basketball Easter basket at Dollar Tree for $1.25. And then I found this little hooded um, Bugs Bunny towel at Burlington for $6.99. And then the little plushies. He has a little bunny from Dollar Tree, but I found Bugs Bunny from Dollar Tree. And also, I forgot, Daffy Duck from Dollar Tree. Um, so I put those in there. And then the Easter eggs are empty right now, but I'm just going to put like little candies in there. I got the little basketball ones to go in there so it's like a little space jam basket oops and i almost forgot his stickers these are space jam stickers from the dollar tree and how cute are those and you guys he just had a space jam birthday so i thought this was perfect perfect for a space jam little basket and then his last basket i'll get to right now but next to the space jam basket i'm gonna be putting his little you guys my hair i don't like wearing it down because i mess with it too much i'm sorry um, his little Easter egg, it's a basketball. These were from, you can find these at the Dollar Tree and also the 99 cent store, but I just stuck little magic ink markers cause he always, um, runs through these really fast. It came in a two pack, but I just took it out of the packaging to stick in the egg. And then I gave him a little chocolate covered marshmallow treat also from the Dollar Tree, I believe. And then these little they look like Easter eggs, but they're gum. These came in the four or five pack from Target. So that's gonna be his little egg there. And then for his little plastic bunny, I like to stick something in here. So I got them swim shorts, which I always like to do. If I could get this open, I'm sorry. Oops, kind of loud. These are from Ross and I paid $6.99 for them. And he still has a rash guard from last year, but I might get him a new one also. And I just like the ombre from yellow to like a faded orange for the summertime. I think that's so cute for him. So that's his bunny. And then for his last basket here, it's more of like with the treats and some special items. 
I know you guys, it's a lot of stuff, but I'm trying to get through it fast. Um, these baskets were from Target. They still carry them this year. Oops. And let's go through it so you guys could see all the goodies. Oh, before I mess up the basket, the little carrot, if you guys could see it. The carrot thing is, the Beat It Garland carrot thing is from Dollar Tree this year. So I thought that was so cute. I added, oops, both to, one to each basket for the boys. Um, so we'll start here. We got him a new little Nike hat from the Nike store. It was regular 22 and we got it for $12.99. He loves Squishmallows, guys. But this isn't a Squishmallow, but it is a, like a little plush. This is from TJ Maxx slash HomeGoods since ours is together. It was $5.99. So you can find that either one or also I think I've seen them at Marshalls this year. But i seen this a few, oh God, maybe a month and a half ago, month and, a half ago and I had to grab it because it's so, so cute. And then I found these Squishmallows at Five Below and we love Disney. So the Lion King came out with a line. So I found uh, Simba and Nala. And I grabbed him both. I just couldn't decide, you guys. And they have little tails. So those are so cute to add to his Squishmallow collection. He loves crybabies. And I found these at Target on an end cap. I think they're getting in new ones. They're regular $9.99. I got it for $2.99. So I grabbed quite a few of these. I also put one in his um, Valentine's Day basket this year. And then we're going to go through the candy really fast. So I just got him some... Um, gummies we love these and i give them a lot of candy because we do do like movie night sorry you guys my hair and um we go to disneyland quite we try to go maybe once a month now um so we do like to take candy and snacks in the car and also you could take snacks inside disney so a lot of this will last for a while and then i got him these sour punch straws these are like the easter edition these are i believe like a dollar 25 at target that's where I got those from. And I got him a Kinder Egg from Target. I think these are $1.99. Tic Tacs from Target, $1. These are just the Easter edition. It has little bunnies on there. Um, they both like peeps, but they, I think both enjoy the peeps that are dipped in chocolate. So I got these from Target also. I believe these were like $1.49. And then from Walmart, okay, Cash is like Dr. Pepper obsessed. He loves Dr. Pepper. So when I seen these this year, I had to grab them. Even if he doesn't like it, he just wants to try it. I think that would be fun for him. I would probably even try one of those, even though I don't care for peeps anymore. I used to. But as I gotten older, I don't really care for like marshmallow anymore. I don't know why. But I still like um, like Rice Krispie treats, but just like marshmallow by itself, not so much. Um, these are from the Dollar Tree. They're Easter decorating um, cookie kits. And that's how it looks in the back. And it comes with the icing and the sprinkles. And I seen someone else open it. And it's like such a cute bunny. So I'm doing them a Peter Rabbit themed breakfast on Easter morning. So I might open this and put this on their table. Like as they're setting. Their place setting. And then they could kind of make their cookie as I'm making them breakfast. I think that would be so cute. Um... Or, like, I think it's just a cute idea. And then, um, for a little chocolate, I think it's just milk chocolate. Comes in a four-pack from Target. It's just a small one. It's a, I gave him the one with the butterfly and a flower on it. And then he gets a little water gun from Walmart. I believe these were, like, $1.25. From Dollar Tree, I found these um, Mike and Ike's little tube candy with the purple little egg. Also Target from Favorite Day, it is a chocolate, Belgium milk chocolate bark. And it has like sprinkles and it's shaped as a bunny, if you could kind of see there. I think that's so, so cute. And I also found these Easter wands at Walmart for 98 cents and they glow in the dark. So I thought that was so cute. And these Sour Patch Kids, the bunny edition. And then each boy, every year, I like to give them a carton of the confetti eggs to crack over each other. But I just don't like how the carton looks. So this year, I seen on Pinterest, like, some people wrap their carton eggs. And I did the same with just some craft paper from Dollar Tree, um, twine from Dollar Tree, and then leftover greenery I just had around the house. 
And I found these really cute Easter stickers at Hobby Lobby, so I just stuck a few stickers on there for their little confetti egg. So I thought that was so cute and something neutral um, for the boys. And then I have their Easter outfits. Oh, you know what? I have one more pair of shoes for cash. So we found him some Nikes at the Nike store. I don't know if he's gonna wear these with his Easter outfit or these are just like regular shoes for him just cause he needs new ones. But we got these all white ones. They're the Nike free run. And I think regular they're like 50 to 60 and I believe we paid $29.99. So I thought those were so, so cute. Okay, so that's everything for cash. Let me show you Ethan's now since, you know, one kid to the next. I'm trying to move all this stuff. So Ethan, since it's in front of me, same thing, carton of eggs. Did the same neutral wrapping for his um, confetti eggs. So with Ethan's main basket, let me see if I could grab it without dropping anything. Oh, it's heavy, guys. Oh, his marshmallow fell over, but I'll show you. So Ethan's main basket and then his name tag. And I think it's so cute. The same basket from Hearth and Hand from last year. Um, let me show you. He has the same chocolate bunny. Like I like to call him little Peter Rabbit bunny. So freaking cute. So we have that one. He has this banner. It says Hippity Hop. Happy Easter for $1.49 at Walmart. Like I said, a great deal. And then his little marshmallow stick. Oh my God, it's so cute. $3.99 at Home Goods. He got more of like the red and blue colors. And then his bunny is like a blue tone up here. And then Ethan loves Pokemon. So we got him three packs of these Pokemon cards. I believe I bought these at Best Buy is where I could find the best deal now. Um, at Best Buy, they're still $3.99 a pack everywhere else. Um, they seem like they're like four like about $4.75 now almost. And I couldn't find any Pokemon at Walmart. Um, one of the associates told me that they might not be selling Pokemon cards there anymore. So I'm not too sure. So Best Buy or Target, if you're looking for Pokemon cards. He got the same bunch of balloons, but he got purple and green. He got the same water gun from Walmart for $1.25. He got the same light up necklace, even though he probably won't wear it. I just had to throw it in there. And the same little wood craft from Dollar Tree. He's a preteen, so he's starting to like really wanting to take care of his skin. Um, he likes to wear cologne at school now, things like that. So I found this Friedman um, Pill Off Clay Mask for clarifying. It's sweet tea and lemon and it brightens your skin. This was actually from the Dollar Tree. They had got a whole line of Freeman stuff in. So I thought that was a really good deal because um, these masks are about 4 to $5 at Target or Walmart. So he mentioned he wants to start taking care of his skin. So I've been buying him like, like skincare to try out. And he loves Rick and Morty. I know it's not the most age appropriate, but you know, he's a boy, he's a preteen, almost. Um, I found these at Burlington, some socks, and they were only $2.99, which I thought was a great deal because they feel like good quality. So I thought he would really get a kick out of those and like to wear those. Um, his shoes that we got him, he got quite a few pairs for Christmas, so he didn't need as much shoes. Um, but we also found him some Nike Air Maxes at where did we find these at? These were at Burlington for $29.99. So I thought that was a great deal. And they're just like a navy blue and white. So those are for his spring shoes. Um, for his tail, since Cash got the Bugs Bunny, also Ethan loves Harry Potter. We got him a Harry Potter towel for the summer and springtime. It's a beach towel and it just has all the colors there and I thought that was very cute um this was also $6.99 at Burlington he got the same flying airplane um his is in the camo print and then his uh clothing we found a few shirts so this one was from art class at Target it was marked down at two dollars and forty cents so I grabbed it short sleeve we live in California so it gets hot today's gloomy so I don't know if you could tell um, it's kind of dark. And then this one was also a dollar at Walmart. Sorry if you could hear our house phone ringing. <laughs> I found this was the best deal ever. It's a dry fit shirt 
from Walmart. It's by the Russell brand. It came up three cents, three pennies, three pennies. So I grabbed him this one. And then this one came up $1, all black. It was in the men's department. They are size medium, so they're, they're gonna be a little big on him. He's like usually a men's small or boys extra large. But I thought for a dollar and three, you know, and the other shirt was only three pennies, I couldn't pass it up. And then he got new pajamas from Walmart. Um, he likes bottoms, so these are like great joggers. It came in a set. And then this one here, do not disturb. Um, it was regular $10.98 and they had it marked down to $9. But when I scanned it, it came up, I believe, $3. So I grabbed that for him. And then I like to do matching pajamas on the morning of Easter. Um, so I'm probably going to go back and get them matching pajamas for Easter um, morning. Not an Easter print because Cash doesn't like pants anymore. He likes wearing shorts. Um, so I'll probably grab them both matching shorts somehow. And then his Easter egg is soccer. He loves soccer. He, they both play soccer, but Ethan's been playing soccer longer. Like I said, he's a preteen, so he's starting to care about what he smells like, looks like at school. So I just got him this first backpack. It's a speed stick deodorant. And then these face and body cleansing wipes for after PE. Um, they're the charcoal face and body by Nobleman. These were from Dollar Tree. So we'll see how those work out for him. And then for his um sports theme we went with a soccer basket you see there the basket is from the dollar tree and then also from the dollar tree are these cones he wants to do like more drills so i got him it comes in a two pack from dollar tree so i got him three sets and then i got him this large soccer ball from five below it's huge it's like a jumbo jumbo soccer ball for five dollars um it's inflatable. I'm also gonna use this for, he's gonna have a soccer themed birthday in May. So I thought this would be a really good prop. So hopefully he doesn't pop it. It's almost like a huge beach ball. Um, if not, I'll go back to five below and buy another one. And then his eggs, I'm just gonna put like little jelly beans when it gets closer to Easter. And then I found this FIFA backpack at Walmart. I took it out of its packaging. It's like a drawstring backpack from uh, the World Cup this year. I think it's so cute. I think originally it was only $5, but it rang up you guys for a dollar and it was the last one and I was hunting for this. So he's gonna flip out when he sees this. He loves, he like watched the soccer World Cup every day and was like screaming so into it. So he'll love that. And then for his other basket here, same thing, I made their name tags a few years ago, just from Dollar Tree things. Um, let's get into it because I know this video is getting long already. He got the, what is it? Scar from Lion King from Five Below for five. I believe these are one up from, they're like $5.55. So I thought that one was so cute. So those are the only three that came out with the Lion King um, edition. I thought they were going to come out with the dad. I forgot his name. Simba, but they never, they didn't. So I was surprised. So I got Ethan Scar because I feel like this is more age appropriate because he looks angry. <laughs> he got the same little Belgium chocolate bunny. He got the chocolate dip peeps. He got this little chocolate bar from Target. It came in a five pack. He got the same Tic Tacs. I'm just going over the candy really fast. The same chocolate cover marshmallow bunny. Um, the same little Easter gum. His favorite, favorite, Cash got the um, the Kinder Egg, so I got Ethan the Cadbury Egg, because Cash does not like Cadbury Eggs. Ethan loves Cadbury Eggs, so I got him the original Cadbury Egg, just one this year. And then Cash doesn't chew gum, Ethan loves the Big Chew, the Big League Chew, so I got him the Easter Edition one. This was also from Target. I believe it was like a dollar twenty-five. And if you can't find that, you can also find that at um, Five Below. And then he got the same Sour Patch gummies. His little um, Easter tube is Airhead, or no, not Airheads, the Warheads Sour Jelly Beans. He got the same cookie decorating kit, the same Bunny Hopper gummies, and the Sour Punch. And then since Cash got more in his basket as far as like Squishmallows, things like that, um, 
Ethan doesn't really care for little knickknacks anymore. So for him, I he wanted a pair of Crocs. So I got him just an all black pair. So he could stick any gibbets he wants in there. And it's neutral. These I got ordered off Amazon for, I believe they were $33 at the time when I ordered them. And then his um, big toy, like, oh, I forgot to show you Cash's big toy. I'll show you. He got a hockey set. So um, this one I found at Target. It was originally $19.99 and I bought it for $5.99. The box is a bit beat up. I don't know if it was like a return, but it was the only one there and I thought this is so cool for them for summer and spring to go outside and play. So he got that as his big gift. And Cash's big gift, I forgot to show you guys, is this one from Walmart. It's Crayola. It's a mini marker sprayer. So you put the marker inside and it comes with, I think, 12 coloring sheets and it ends up spraying like an airbrush um, gun. So I thought that was so cool. I don't know how much this rang up regular, um, but I got it on clearance for $4.50. So I thought that was an amazing deal. I went back like two days later to get Ethan one because he really likes art stuff and they were all gone. So um, yeah, I scored this one for cash. Okay, so that is everything for their Easter baskets, I believe. Now I'm gonna show you kind of like the Easter candy um, and some of the Easter up, how I'm gonna wrap their Easter baskets. I will post that on my Pinterest and my um, Instagram. So if you guys wanna follow me there, I will leave it in the description box below my um, name. Um, once they're fully wrapped, I like to take pictures and then post it there to give you guys like an idea how it looks. So let me grab the candy and their Easter outfits. Oh, you know their Easter outfits are right here. I have them in a bag. So these are Cash's Easter shoes. I thought they were so cute. They're from Target. They were $24.99 and they got marked down to $7.49. They're like a gray Velcro, like mid-high top. And it has like this tone here, which I really like for the springtime because it matches his outfit pretty well. Let me take it out of this bag so it's not so loud. Um, Cash's outfit is from Target. And it's just floral, short sleeve. Like I said, we live in Southern California. It's been really, really cold here. But um, I think on Easter, I, it should be about 73 degrees. So that's perfect. But um, his was $23 and I got it in a 5T. And it comes with like these navy blue pants. The cute little floral shirt, which I like because it doesn't say anything Easter. It's just floral so you can wear it during springtime. A little bow tie and then the little shoes. I thought we were so cute with it. So I don't know if he's going to wear these shoes or his white Nikes we bought him. But that's his Easter outfit. Ethan's outfit is from Walmart from Free Assembly. He, we got him this like floral print. Um, it's like an off-white and navy blue shirt. And this one was $15. We got it in an extra, uh, extra, extra large boys. And it is a button down, also short sleeve. I love that. And then I found these gray joggers at Walmart for him. He likes to be more comfortable, which I understand. Um, these were in the men's section. It's by No Boundaries. They were $19.49 originally, but I scanned them because they were just on the clearance rack. It didn't have a clearance sticker, but they came up $5, and he got a men's extra small. So that's Ethan's Easter outfit. And for him, I think we're going to either buy him some white slip-on vans, or he might just wear like a pair of shoes he has already because he's very picky. He has another new pair of shoes, but... He told me he don't want to wear them, so whatever. Um, and let me show you some of the Easter candy and eggs. So these gold eggs, I'm just going to put some money in them. They can Easter egg hunt with those, the golden egg, the money egg. Um, these we got from Dollar Tree. I don't know what I'm going to put in there yet. I don't know if I'm going to do like little special goodies. Um, but we got these carrot ones from Dollar Tree this year and then these ones were really cute from the 99 cent store. These ones were $1.29. has like a blue bunny face. They feel like burlap. It comes in a two pack with the plaid ears. And then I didn't include this in Cash's Easter basket but I might give it to one of my nieces or nephews. It's I Love My Baby. Um, it was at Walmart. Again, another hidden clearance find. It came up 71 cents. So I'm guessing it was probably like a Valentine's Day book, but the page, the illustrations are like so, so pretty. 
And I think that's just so cute with the little bunnies on the front. So I just grabbed that book there. Window cleans for cash from Target Dollar Spot. He likes to put these on the back window for $1. And then let me show you some of the wrap I'm going to use. Um, this one was from Walmart for $1.24 for the Easter baskets. It just has like colored jelly beans. I don't know if you really can see. The lighting got really dark in this room because the clouds, the overcast. So I got two rolls of this one and two rolls of this one. This one is from the 99 cent store. These were 99 cents. And this one has a different color, like little Easter bunnies on it. And then with that, sorry, I'm just kind of grabbing. I grabbed some ribbon. So a uh, yellow polka dot ribbon to make bows from the 99 cent store. Those were 99 cents. <laughs> Let me see if I could grab this without having a... Okay, Dollar Tree. I got this really pretty like burlap blue. Also Dollar Tree, a burlap orange. And Dollar Tree, this really, really pretty one. You know, I didn't realize how pretty this is, so I might go back and grab another roll because as you can see, it's like outlined in like a glitter. So that's really cute. And then let me show you some of the Easter candy really fast. So these are the packs of gum that I got. It comes in a four pack, I believe for like a dollar 50 around there at Target. So I grabbed a few packs of those. I grabbed multiple color packs of Peeps. Um, the best price on Peeps, these are like at the Dollar Tree for $1.25. And I believe these are a dollar, under a dollar fifty at Walmart. And you get an eight pack. So I got the yellow and the pink, and then I got blue. And what I'm going to do is the boys like peeps, but this year I'm gonna to try to make s'mores. I seen on Pinterest um, out of the peeps. So what you do is you buy, I bought it already, the melt chocolate chips. You just put in a dish and you put the peeps on top, you melt it for a few minutes, and then you dip it with the graham cracker. So I thought that would be really good for Easter day. I think that's a cute idea. I got the Easter dots. My husband loves those. Some more sour patches. These little marshmallow bunny feet. I thought that would be really cute for their place settings on Easter morning for the Peter Rabbit theme. These were from Target. I believe these were $2.99 or $3.99. And it comes in a four pack. And then I got some of these Tootsie Little Pops. These are, or not Pops, the like Tootsie Rolls, but watermelon flavor from Dollar Tree. They were $1.25. And let me move off this over here. Let me see. I got six of these, so I needed 24. They come in a four pack of the Smarties for Cash's class since I'm making them goodie bags. Um, so I grabbed these from Dollar, I believe these were Dollar Tree, and I haven't seen them again. I grabbed these a while ago. So I thought not bad, a dollar twenty-five for four full-size boxes. So I grabbed six six packs of these. And then another whole bag of candy guys. These are um, all for, not their basket, but like for the Easter egg hunt that we do with family. So I found these at Dollar Tree, the Warheads um, Ooze Sticks. Get 16 pieces for $1.25, which is not bad. Some Reese's Easter eggs. It comes in a four pack at Dollar Tree. For Cash's class, I grabbed two bags of these Tiger Easter Pops. They look like little, you can see the designs there. Um, 22 lollipops for $1.25. I thought that was great. So I grabbed two bags of those. I don't know why I grabbed these. I can't remember, but <laughs> bottle caps, I guess because they're nostalgic maybe. Um, I grabbed a bag of the cookies and cream. Palmer eggs um, to stuff the eggs with. So this is all to stuff the eggs with. And then, okay, I grabbed two bags of those at the Dollar Tree. So all this candy right now is from the Dollar Tree. I grabbed these peanut butter eggs. They're really cute. Um, also by Palmer. These I've never seen before. We opened the blue ones. They were a little too sweet for me, but they were good. They're the sour blue, berry blue jello. Squares and also we haven't tried these ones sour cherry only at the Dollar Tree you guys so I thought that was interesting I grabbed both flavors 
another bag of those peanut butter eggs, one bag of the Starburst jelly beans, and then two bags of these uh, Sour Punch, like individually wrapped straws for the eggs also. And then lastly, let me just show you really quick. I'm gonna make Cash's teacher and Ethan's one teacher um, a little goodie. So I found, I believe one, this one was at the 99 cent store. They were $1.29. So I think I'm gonna give this one a Cash's teacher. It has a little Easter bunny. Put a Target gift card in there or a Starbucks gift card with like a few pieces of, um, probably like some chocolates and then um, maybe some permanent markers. And then the same thing for Cash's teacher, Ethan's teacher, I found this one at the 99 cent store, which is like little ducks and Easter eggs. And I thought I had another bag of candy. Oh, I do. Let me show you really quick. And that um, teacher gift, I was thinking about putting one of these Lindor chocolate carrots in there. So I'll use two for the boys, Peter Rabbit theme breakfast, and then put um, one in each little bucket and then some a gift card so i thought that would be really cute those are from target i believe these were like five dollars and then these are where i got the little chocolate bars from target comes in a four pack these were like a dollar 25 or a dollar 49. i got a few packs of these chocolate covered marshmallows from dollar tree a pack of these Dove chocolates from Target. This one is the chocolate ganache. That sounds really good. And then I got multiple packs of these golden eggs. So um, last year, or this year too, they saw tar or Dollar Tree, I'm sorry, the blue little, um, looks like a gumball machine, but it's an egg shape. So I'm gonna fill these with this and put this on their table skate for their Peter Rabbit theme table skate. I like to grab this because I like to um, make little treats. It's edible Easter grass. Um, last year I made it. I put it on my Pinterest if you want to check it out. It was um, a little mini bird's nest with robin egg themed candy inside. And I put this like as the nest. And it was so, so cute. Like as the little nest part. Or the nest was the Rice Krispie treat. And I put this as like the grass. It was really, really cute. So that was from Target. And then I grabbed these just to do like a themed breakfast. The... Pastel m &Ms. I also grabbed the carrots, the chocolate carrots, a box of these Reese's Pieces Easter eggs. And then let me show you what I'm doing for their Peter Rabbit theme. If I could reach it. So for their Peter Rabbit themed breakfast, I found these at Home Goods for $6.99. It's the baking cups and the little picks. And you guys, I priced these at other places and they're like $23. People were like reselling these. So you guys find them at Home Goods or TJ Maxx. I found mine at Home Goods. Such a cute idea. I'm gonna make them cupcakes and then maybe put something like very cute in here, like little chocolates or something. Also, Home Goods, I found the napkins, Peter Rabbit theme. Those were $4.99. So cute. Along with the plates. These were $3.99 and it comes with 16 plates and I thought that was adorable. Also at Home Goods, I should have grabbed two. There was two left, but I just grabbed one. Comes with eight um, disposable Peter Rabbit cups and it comes with like the lids and the little Peter Rabbit sleeves. And these were $4.99. So that is it, you guys. Um, if you also want to see a little mini haul, I posted it on my Instagram shorts. Um, a shorts video of Easter haul that I did of just like kind of decor stuff I bought and this is just baskets so check back on my Pinterest and Instagram if you want to follow me there and I'll be posting once the baskets are fully done and wrapped and what we do on Easter morning thank you guys for watching and until next time bye bye